Hey, so I'm gonna do my first ever hair tutorial. Bear with me, I'm new. I'm doing a style that is inspired to me by Gabrielle from Xena Warrior Princess. So, fingers crossed. Okay, <clears throat> so we got dry hair. First, we're gonna section it off just a little bit so that I can work with the right parts that I wanna work with. I really hope this comes out good, I'm so excited. Nervous too, mostly excited. Okay. So we're gonna take braid balm, pre-pep, and we're gonna put that, take my ring off. Here's where I get nervous. Here's where I get nervous. So let's hope. Now, I know, I know, I look really funny. I really do. I acknowledge this. Section this part off. Look at that. That's awesome. It goes so fast. And then, oops. So, eh. it was a little further to the end. And then spin. And then I count to 10 in my head. And then just let go. Look at that. Look how beautiful that is. So I always wished when I was little that I could just take my head off and put it in front of me and do my hair and then put my head back on. There's this really cute uh, movie I watched when I was little, uh, Return to Oz. And there was a, the, the bad lady, it's, I shouldn't want to be the bad lady, but the bad lady, she had an assortment of heads. And I always thought that would be so cool. Obviously, you know, biology and anatomy and, and whatever other scientific reasons, we can't just take our heads off. But ever since finding, look at that, ever since finding the beach waver, I've been able to actually curl my hair and it's amazing. Even the ones in the back that you can barely see. And the best part about it is I don't burn myself because I am known for burning myself. So let's finish getting all these curls done.
So the great thing that I love about the beach waver is that it curls in either direction. You have two arrows on it. You can choose if you want it to go this way or if you want it to go this way. So for someone like me, who is ambidextrous but gets very confused at what I'm doing, it makes it a lot easier for me to curl because it'll do whichever direction I need it to. But that also means that for anyone who is left-handed versus right-handed, it'll be easy for you. Or if you curl differently, depending on which side of your head you're on, it makes that easy too. I'm gonna just keep my bangs out of the way here. Okay, so as you can see, we got a whole lot of nice curls right here. Now you can do curls if you want to do curls, but there's also that lovely style that we all love known as waves in your hair, which is what I'm going for this time. So we're just gonna brush them out. Look at that. Look how beautiful that is. So let's take this out. Now I might leave my bangs flat. I'm not sure yet. We're going to finish the rest of our style first. Just uh, keep this out of my way so I can see what I'm doing and what we're gonna do. I'm so excited! I hope this works. And take our braids. Your fingers are crossed, right? I need, I need, I need all of you to cross your fingers right now. I have dreamed of this hairstyle and I've never done it. It would probably be easier with a tiny little clip, but I don't have one. Like something cute and little, maybe like a butterfly. A little more, should be tight enough. Okay, so we're gonna undo some little bits of the braid. We're going to curl this last little piece for sure so it fits in with everything. Look how nice and cared for that is. Like, no flyaways or anything. That's the wonderful thing that I like about the braid bomb is it helps to keep your braids nice and tight and tidy. Um, some people like loose braids, that's okay too. But it keeps them um, from looking like we were five when we did it. Okay, so this last little curl. Oops, wrong way. See, doesn't matter. You do it the wrong way, you just turn it around and do it the other way and you're great. One, two. I'm gonna let that go. Hi. 
How does it look? Does it look great? Oh, I'm so excited. Look at that. There we go. That's perfect. I think we will give a little bit of curl to the bangs. I do think they need just a smidge. So one, two, three, four, five, instead of 10 for just that little bit. And since this is a one inch barrel, the curls are open and looser, which is, ah, oops, which is good. Let's do, yeah, we're just gonna do all this as one. One, two, three, four, five. Just for that little bit. And then I will post some pictures of the after, some photos on Instagram. So be sure to check that out. One, two, three, four, five. And this one, I'm going to do this way to control a little bit of that curl. One, two, three, four, five. Just a little, just a little bit. So there we go. I did it. I did it. It came out so great. I'm so excited. Thank you guys so much for being part of this with me. I hope that you liked it as much as I enjoyed making it for you. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.